guys welcome to another vlog i decided to vlog today and maybe the next few days we'll see it's currently around like 10 45 and i'm about to my <laughs> my panda squishmallow i am about to go on a hike with annika she also has a blog i'm gonna link it below for you guys because she posts so many great like diys and hacks and like thrifting hacks and like cool stuff like that and also baking she's really good at all that stuff anyways we're going on a hike this is the fit i'm wearing a Lulu Swiftly long sleeve. This is super old, but I really want to get a new one. And then I'm wearing a Lulu sports bra underneath as well. Lulu Wonder Under leggings. And then some Nike socks. That's the fit. And then I've also got my Patagonia quarter zip that I'm gonna bring with me. I think I'm also gonna bring a rain jacket just in case, but currently it's not raining. So that's great. I hope it doesn't rain today. Fingers crossed. But yeah, I do have to go now. So let's go. I also have a backpack. This one's also Lulu. I think I've mentioned it in another one of my videos. Backpack, I've got my hydro flask. I just decided that for the hike, I'm going to just carry this because I kind of like having everything. I'm gonna bring my vlog camera. I got a protein bar snack and other stuff, lip balm, all the good stuff, so. Bringing a rain jacket in case, and that's it. My brother drove last time, so the seat is, uh, like, all back. Better tell Annika I'm leaving. My past few videos, my camera has been super overexposed, and I don't know why. I, actually, I do. My settings were weird for some weird reason, which that's what I don't know why. But I recently changed it, and I also changed the quality. Like, I didn't know I could make the quality of my camera better. So, I'm really excited. Like, my camera has been looking really good. I hope you guys have been noticing the difference as well. But yeah, I'm gonna go drive now, and I'll see you guys with Annika soon. Okay, guys, we just made it to the parking lot. It's Annika! Hey! Woo! I'm back! <laughs> Annika's back, second feature in, on the YouTube channel. But we just parked and the hike we're doing is Cypress Falls. We'll let, let you know how it goes. It's supposed to be like easy to moderate, right? Like, I think it's an easier one. It's definitely gonna be easier. But it's a nice one, apparently. Yes, and the end is like a waterfall, so that'll be nice. And a little under two hours, right? Yes. Okay. I believe one hour in, one hour out. Yay! Time and for a hot chocolate. Easy. Oh yeah, so Annika brought her like little mini stove. She is like a pro at like just camping, hiking, all that stuff. She's an outdoorsy <laughs> gal. So, you know, I trust her with everything and she has all the equipment, so. Pressure's on. The pressure's on, I'm always like, I'm like, Annika, okay, you choose the hike for today. <laughs> I'm like, I, I fully trust you with the hike. Just decide and yourself. And like 10, <laughs> 10 things. I'm like, we can do this one, but then there's this, we can do this one. <laughs> and I'm like, you choose. And she's like, uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Anyways, okay, we're gonna go now. Like, we'll show the destination, I guess, when we I get there. Guess. We're on this little thingy and we're gonna have some coffee. I hope you can hear me. It's literally so loud because of the waterfall, but it's actually so nice. And there's no one else on the trail. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I'm changing. <laughs> Monica has this little mini stove that she takes with her and we just boiled some water and then made some coffee with like instant coffee and it's so cute. I love it. Such a vibe right by the falls here. Hey guys, it's the next day and I just got back from lunch with Indigo but I wanted to show you guys. I like have this new hair trick that I am obsessed with like doing. My hair has never looked better and I this is my second time doing it now. Basically, I curl my hair. I'll show you guys the curling one, but I curl my hair the night before because I don't know about you guys. I'm someone who's like so lazy with like curling my hair the morning of like going somewhere or like going out. Unless I'm like going out at nighttime, I guess, but like I'm just so lazy to curl my hair in the morning. I'd rather just like do my makeup and then be done. But I curl my hair at night and then I put my hair in like a loose bun at the top of my head and I sleep with it in a loose bun but like I twist my hair like this into a bun wrap it around and then put it at the top of my head and sleep with it so it kind of like locks my curls in overnight and my curls stay like last time I did this, this is my second time doing this like I said but like last time I did this my hair stayed curly and looking so good for like four days like it looked 
so good. And so it's my new favorite trick and I'll show you guys the curling iron. This is the curling iron that I've been using and literally it's my mom's, like she's had it for years and it's a clamp curling iron so it's not a wand and this has changed the game for me. For the longest time I was like using a straightener to curl my hair but this just like does such a different job. It makes my curls bigger and bouncier and more like voluminous than a straightener would make my curls look so I've been really liking a clamp curler recently and in general I've also just really been enjoying like my skin and my makeup lately and I think it's because I've been using the Charlotte Tilbury flawless filter as my base and then what I've been doing is I use it all over my face and it makes my skin look super glowy and then in my previous video I showed that I've been really liking the glow screen so I use the glow screen and then I use the flawless filter and like it just gives a whole nother level of glow but this has been really nice and then I use my NARS concealer just to like add a little more coverage for some of my acne scars or like pimples that I have so that's been working really well for me and I've just been really vibing with my look lately my hair because I have this new amazing trick and then my skin too and my makeup I just feel really good I don't know I just feel really good for spring so I'm gonna continue doing that that's gonna be my whole thing I'm gonna curl my hair before I go to bed and then put it up in a bun and then it's gonna look great for like three days so I'm so excited and I don't even use any hairspray or anything. It just like locks the curls in. It's like incredible. So I'm so happy. And now I want to show you guys. I have like a bit of a haul. So let's go to my room and I'll show you guys some things that I got recently. Okay, so I'm just gonna sit on my floor, but I got so much stuff from Abercrombie and Fitch recently And they were so kind to send me a bunch of clothing to style for spring So I'm so excited. I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got because everything's so cute First is this pink tank top and it's actually super soft. I think it's a part of their soft A&F collection and i've been so into this pink color recently guys i've been so into pink recently and so many stores that i've been like kind of browsing around at like aritzia zara so many popular stores have been carrying this like cute little blush pink and i'm just obsessed with it so i picked this one up and it's really cute I'm obsessed. It kind of like scoops lower a little bit and I like that because I feel like I could layer it with like another white tank underneath. I don't know, maybe not this one, but I feel like that'd be really cute. So that's the first thing. I'm going to change it to this after. And then I feel like I've been needing a new like white tee, but like you know how you have your basics, but like you have like a few different tees because like they all fit a certain way. It's like I have like a tighter fitting white tee and obviously that is worn for different things, but like you need also kind of like a looser white tee. <laughs> so then I got this like Plain white tee and I got it in a medium. I'm normally a small and this one's a little bit looser. This is also really soft. I think this is also, yeah, this one's also their soft ANF collection. I'm kind of picturing this outfit that I was inspired by Matilda Jerf. She wore kind of like a looser white tee and then she wore like a white button up on top open and then she wore like trousers and her New Balance shoes and that's just kind of like the vibe I want to go for with this but then also this would be really nice just for like sleeping or literally anything so and then i also got i want to move this down a bit i also picked up this really cute okay it's all messed up right now okay i fixed it it's this super cute little set and it's ribbed and it's baby blue and there's two pieces to it so first piece is the cardigan and then under inside there's this little tube top which is adorable and you can wear them together and you can wear them separate and i'm just obsessed and this is such a cute color for spring you can wear it with jeans trousers anything you can wear i'm picturing the tube top just alone with black trousers too it would be really cute i love this and it's also really soft i'm gonna link everything down below so if you guys like anything and you want to pick it up i'll have it all linked for you okay next okay you're gonna die i got this set it's like this blue button up and it's oversized i really like this blue color i'm super into button ups right now and i've been wanting some new button ups for spring that have like some color because i have a white one that i thrifted and i have a pinstriped white and blue one and i feel like i need like some colors like pops of colors so this blue is really nice i kind of want a pink one too so maybe i'll try and thrift a pink one but yeah and then that's the top and then to match with it are these bottoms and they're the same color and they're like these little shorts same material and you can wear them separate you can wear them together i don't know if you guys have seen i'm i'm such a pinterest girl and I've also been obsessed with just like i already mentioned matilda jerf but like i'm obsessed with jerf avenue too and i really 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 want to invest in one of their pieces they're quite expensive but i really want to pick something up because they have such cute basics and they're like well 
well known for this whole like button up matching with like the similar like same bottoms matilda wears them to like together in the morning and it's just so aesthetic so i'm really excited for this because it's very just like Fifth avenue pinterest inspired and i think this would also just be really cute with like a white tank i could wear this open really cute and then last but not least is this leather blazer which i've also been feeling like i need so i'm really glad that i could pick one up from abercrombie just a black leather blazer and this vegan leather really great quality i got it in a size small and it fits just like slightly oversized so it's perfect yeah really cute for like going out for dinner events stuff like that so i'm very excited that i finally have a leather blazer i do have a few blazers already i have just a plain black one and i have a beige one from princess polly so they're both really nice and I honestly kind of want to also get myself like a gray oversized blazer and a gray pair of trousers too. Those are some things on my list right now. But yeah, that was my little Abercrombie haul. And I'm obsessed with everything that I got. I will link everything below for you guys. I'm really happy about everything and I can't wait to share me wearing them in photos on Instagram. So make sure to follow me because I will be posting photos wearing all the pieces that I just showed. This is currently the state of my desk and I feel very like unorganized and a little bit frantic. I got a package in from Garage. I'll show you what I got. And I just need to clean this up and then get to work. Also, my tulips are literally flopped over. But but they're still cute like they still look really good so I don't know I'm gonna leave them they're still cute I went to the gym this morning showered washed my hair so my hair is just air drying right now and I'm wearing my little Abercrombie button up with my Brandy Melville sweatpants that's my outfit right now earlier I was wearing the shorts with it as well and it was so cute it's honestly really comfy so I'm gonna link it down below I did the haul in this video too so everything's linked below this is one of the things I got from garage it's this graphic tee it's actually super cute they have really cute graphic tees and they have like a lot of different options it's also really soft so we love i'm gonna prop this up so i can show you guys okay this is the graphic tee it's like a beige cream color and i got it in a medium large they have like extra small small or medium large and i got medium large because i like oversized but i feel like it's like too oversized for me so i definitely love the style and i love how it feels but i think i might exchange it for an extra small but yeah i would check out garage if you guys want some graphic tees because they have a lot of different options and different colors and different graphics on it so really cute love also this is a garage haul because they had a 20% off spring sale and I picked up a few things because I was eyeing a few things the second thing I got is just the plain white tube top and I was nervous whether this would be long enough or not because I really want just like a plain white tube top that it's going to be like a really good staple for me this spring summer and it'll go like under blazers under like anything basically just like with jeans with trousers and all that but I don't want it to be this short like I want it to be longer so I think I will be returning this unfortunately and I actually found last night I was just browsing the Zara website and I found a tube top on there that's basically just a plain tube top and it's only like 13 bucks so I think I might just pick that one up instead and it looks a lot longer like on the model than this so that's better I think I'll probably just return this one and then buy the white Zara one and then the Zara one also comes in black or pink I think no blue and I think I'll just go with white but if I like really love it then I'll buy it in black too so that's what I got from garage and I got some PR in as well today from Mala the brand if you guys are familiar with the candle company the girl who founded this company went to my school and she was also in the program that I'm in right now so that's awesome and I love that we sent over a candle they wrote a little card to me and it's like one of their summer candles this one is called peaches and cream the are peach orange and vanilla so this is what it looks like super cute and they're soy candles so excited to light this in my room it'll be such a nice scent for summer anyways thank you mala this is gonna be going either on my nightstand or my desk i also have an amazon return to figure out and a few tax forms to figure out too so i have a list of stuff and then i'm gonna edit this vlog so that's what i'm doing i'm also debating making banana bread tonight and i'm not sure if i want to do that yet or if i want to just like chill also guys i start school next week this is my last week to myself before <laughs> my summer semester starts i need to get to work now and clean off my desk Thank you.
you guys so much for watching this vlog I filmed a bit of a longer vlog this time and compiled like multiple days which I'm kind of trying out for my vlogs I also want my vlogs to be really long because personally the vlogs that I like watching on YouTube are usually longer so let me know if you also like that and I can definitely try to make the vlogs longer for you guys and get you guys more content so make sure to subscribe and like this video and comment down below anything I want to talk to you guys and let me know if there's any content that you want to see from me soon. I really appreciate it. Bye!